It's so nice to not be in a portable and to have kids here and, and to be able to connect with staff. Students and staff filled the halls of Valley View Secondary's brand new East Wing for the first time on Monday, leaving behind the portables for indoor classrooms, bright open hallways, common areas and inclusive washrooms. The new addition seems to be making a noticeable difference for teachers and students alike. Just getting out of the portables has been awesome. It was kind of isolating for both the kids uh, and myself just to be able to feel part of the whole Valley View community um, and just to be able to connect with, with colleagues and kids being able to feel like they're, they actually belong here instead of being kind of stuck out in, in the yard. I kind of feel like I'm more in a university more than a high school. Like it, it's just really big. It, it definitely an upgrade, yeah. Portables, they're not my favorite, so I'm really glad they're gone. Um, but I do have a class in the new wing, and the, there's it's so much better because like the big windows and letting all the natural light in. While the $35 million edition isn't 100% complete yet, it has opened to students months ahead of its scheduled opening date in September, something this grade 12 student appreciates. Because we weren't supposed to be able to get into it, so the fact that it's open early is really awesome. It's an awesome experience, and it's cool to see it kind of finished, because or else I wouldn't have. We needed this building so badly. Um, it was our most over capacity um, in the district. Uh, we fought long, hard, we advocated. It is the end of five years, and um, we're here. Students are in this building, even though it's not done. We haven't had our official opening, that'll be in September. To, to be standing here and to have this noise and to have kids running back and forth behind me and in front of me and to have students here, um, it's a wonderful, overwhelming feeling. The new wing has added 525 seats, increasing the school's capacity to 1,200 students and taking away the need for the 12 former portables. The project will be complete in September 2022. For Castanet Kamloops, I'm Kristen Holliday.